Hello YouTubers, myself Asis Patel from Techno Automation and I am going to show you my new uh, homemade smart switch. It is uh, over here. The main benefit of this switch is we can use this switch within our switchboard without changing any hardware. And main functionality which uh, I, I think uh, most important in country like India is we can operate this switch uh, by four different ways. First way is toggle switches uh, which we can found in our uh, so called uh, uh, switchboards we did not have to change any wiring of our existing switchboard uh, for use uh, the smart switch second option is using our laptop or tablet uh, using uh, web page third option is uh, using our android mobile by using specific android application which is running over here you can see the smart switch symbol over here and fourth way is by a voice command so for that I use Amazon Echo dot so let me show how this uh, smart switch is work so first I like to switch on uh, this devices by my mobile phone so as soon as I switch uh, uh, on the all device tab over here all the relay are turned on if I connect any load to this uh, relay it will turn on same way we can operate any switch and the reflection you can see over here okay second way is using uh, toggle switches so uh, I use uh, this toggle switch uh, instead of this because I have this pair in my warehouse so as soon as I turn on uh, this switch the relay is turned on main thing is the reflection of this relay is also you can see in Android app so it will update you if anyone uh, turn on switch uh, physically the software uh, will inform you which switch is turned on and reverse you can turn off that relay using our android mobile third way is using our laptop so here i will show you front light is turned on here the relay is on and here is the graphical uh, update same way all device on all device off now it's turn off amazon echo dot alexa turn on all devices alexa turn off fan so the fan is turned off let me mute Alexa again we can turn off any device using mobile so it is uh, very interactive we can use any four method anytime so how I made this so first uh, main hardware of this device is ESP8266 uh, so the ESP8266 is heart of this project uh, it is connected with this uh, relay board this is a SSR uh, relay board solid state relay uh, for to connect our toggle switch I used uh, piano switches and this is the header using which we can connect our switch to this smart switch this is the SMPS uh, the black one it is 230 volt by 5 volt DC SMPS and uh, the software part uh, I can say all the Android connectivity or web page connectivity or voice connectivity is handled by uh, this Raspberry Pi so this is Raspberry Pi uh, model B uh, don't worry about this camera it is not used in this project it is for my upcoming project so uh, this is all about hardware for software uh, part I used uh, uh, Mosquito MQTT server, uh, Node-RED and uh, Arduino IDE, IDE obviously for to flash ESP8266. Uh, furthermore, uh, for Android application, uh, I use MQTT DAS. So let me show you the, yes, this is the MQTT DAS. Uh, this is the MQTT client using which we can uh, made uh, customize uh, dashboard for our home. Uh, this is all about the demonstration of my project uh, for how to make this project or how to make this kind of uh, switch 
I uh, like to make separate video. Uh, maybe it will uh, be released on next week or next to next week. In that video, I like to cover the software part of ESP8266. How to uh, connect ESP8266 with Raspberry Pi using MQTT and how to make this dashboard using Node-RED and how to implement uh, voice connectivity. Uh, all those things I will be upload uh, in my next video, uh, maybe next to next week. So thank you for watching uh, till now and if you have any suggestion to improve this project, kindly comment and please uh, like my video and share. Thank you once again all.